Do you want to get stretch rest? Here's how to get a stretch resolution in Fortnite Chapter 6 Season 3 step by step. I'll also recommend some of the best stretch resolutions you should be using right now to boost FPS, get bigger hitboxes and reduce input delay. Starting off, here are some of the most popular stretch resolution for all types of PCs. If you've got a medium to high end PC, I would recommend 1720 by 1080, most notably used by Peterbot, 1680 by 1050, a resolution Martos has used in his videos, 1440 by 1080, an ultra wide option if you're going for that extreme stretched look. Now if you're on a low end or potato PC, try one of these, 1024 by 768, 768 by 480 or 800 by 600. When using these stretch resolutions, you will notice that the visibility isn't great but the FPS boost you get makes it worth it. Now that you've picked a stretch resolution to use, let me show you how to actually set it up in Fortnite Chapter 6 Season 3. To actually set up a stretch resolution in Fortnite, there are two methods I'll cover. Method 1 is the easier option and doesn't require an Nvidia or AMD graphics card. Method 2 is a more advanced method that does require an NVIDIA or AMD GPU, but it gives you lower input delay and fixes black bar issues. First, head over to your desktop and press the Windows key plus R. This will bring up the run box. Inside here, type in this command, percent local app data percent, then press enter. This will bring up a folder. In here, press F to find the Fortnite game folder. Then double click it and go to saved config and then windows client folder inside here you should see your config file which is the game user settings file before modifying this right click on it click properties and make sure that the red only box is unchecked if it's checked you won't be able to edit the file once unchecked right click the file again and click open once you're inside a config file scroll down near the bottom and you should see two resolution sections two groups of four values. There will be one section labeled resolution size and then just below that a desired screen width and height. What you want to do is change all resolution values to the one you've chosen. For example, if you're using 4040 by 1080, replace 1920 by 1080 with 4040 by 1080 for each value. Your value should look like this once finished. Once you've updated all of these, press file then save. After saving, close the file. Then, go back to the Gamer User Settings file and right click on it. Click Properties and check the Read Only box. Then click Apply, then OK. This locks the resolution so Fortnite doesn't reset it the next time you launch the game. Once you've done that, you're all good to use your new stretch resolution. With Read Only enabled, you won't be able to change video settings in Fortnite unless you uncheck it again. Now onto method 2. On your desktop, right click, click show more options and open the NVIDIA control panel. If you're on AMD, the steps are very similar. Once opened, go to the left hand side and click on adjust desktop size and position. Inside here, to prevent issues like black bars, set scaling mode to full screen. Under perform scaling on, set it to GPU. Check override the scaling mode set by games and programs. Next, click on change resolution on the left side. Down here at the bottom, hit the customize button. Then check enable resolutions not exposed by the display. Then click create custom resolution. Inside here, set the resolution to the one you chose earlier. I'm doing 1440 by 1080. Then click test. Your screen might go black for a second. That's normal. If a message pops up, press OK. Then your new resolution will now be added. After that, select the resolution you just created in the resolution list and click apply. Your screen will go black again, don't worry. You'll notice your PC is now stretched. Then switch back to 1920 by 1080 and apply again. Yes, your screen will go black once more. This is normal. Doing this locks in the stretch resolution when Fortnite launches. Now just open up Fortnite. Once you're in game, you should immediately notice if it worked. Mine obviously has. You'll be able to tell it's stretched straight away, especially with a resolution like 1440 by 1080. A quick tip before you go, if you have an issue where Fortnite reverts back to native resolution, 
make sure you're playing on windowed full screen mode. This is really important as you must use windowed full screen or stretch resolutions to apply properly. Playing on full screen or windowed might cause the game to reset your resolution back to native. And that's how to get a stretch resolution set up in Fortnite. If this video helped you out, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you're wondering whether you're making any PC gaming mistakes, check out this video next.